the extraterrestrial aliens wanted to change the fate of humanity. The Spaniard Antonio Rivera revealed in his book Las Machinas del Cosmos, The Machines of the World, a strange fact that at that time did not attract much attention. Today, thanks to the latest declassified American intelligence documents, we return to this topic of interactions between humans and aliens. Rivera stated during a meeting, one day we talked about UFOs in a meeting in the presence of lawyer Miguel Alman, former president of Mexico, and one of the people present asked, what do you think about UFOs? All I can tell you, Alman said, is that when I was president, General Dwight Eisenhower was also president in the United States. And during a visit to Mexico, he told me, from president to president, that in 1954, in the southwest of the United States, a disc-shaped aircraft and the bodies of 16 crew members were all, who were small humanoids were presented. Everything was kept absolutely confidential at the airbase. Researchers claimed that in the early morning hours, February 21st, 1954, Eisenhower attended a meeting with the extraterrestrials and that together they would sign a pact. According to the story, the Norse aliens, or the Pleiad human aliens, humanoid aliens, and the U.S. government did not come to an agreement. However, they had come to terms with another alien race, the Greys. Their collaboration included military technology, alien non-interference in human affairs, and no compromise with countries other than the United States would allow them to live on Earth and abduct humans and conduct experiments. Stefano Breccia, an Italian teacher who passed away in 2012, witnessed one of the most amazing alien contact stories where 150 people came into contact with another species of aliens called W-56. Witnesses claimed that aliens have arrived on our own world in the middle of the 1950s and that they were here until the mid-1970s. Their goal was very clear and transparent, to create a new world order based on love and friendship! Exclamation point. Over time, this was called the Friendly Project. Many people were transported to alien bases of these aliens. Most of them had a high social and cultural level. In his book, Mass Contactism, Breckia talks about the ex extraterrestrial project, changing the way we see the relationship between humans and extraterrestrial civilizations. The, uh, the act was presented in Russia, France, Germany, Australia, Chile, Mexico, and Argentina. According to this version, the aliens called W-56 wanted to change the fate of humanity, but a lack of understanding on the part of humans who apparently have relations with the greys ended in the plan, causing them to disappear. And that's why they scoff at such issues. After all, the gray aliens changed fate, and now humanity has fallen to such a lower level and materialistic than spiritual that it once was, that not only such issues do not interest it much, that it considers them nonsense and the type of what um, we care about. And how could they know? They would itch. Uh, what would they care about? Now, we doubt if you understand. They don't even understand who they read, what they read on the internet, and they think what is happening in their personal life, and then they wonder why the, why the word go, world goes from bad to worse, and those who order, who wonder, because most of them don't wonder about anything. Otherwise, there would not be so much ignorance. The very logic that many have is inferior to the circumstances. However, 100 to 150 years ago, people had nothing to do with today's barbarisms, but the barbarians who, uh, who are also hypocrites. And uh, this I've translated for you from a Greek article. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. Finally, support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. 
You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.